Hello and welcome to Rising Stars. Today we just want to show you an activity that you can set up for babies and um, basically a lot of sensory activities, okay, um, a lot of sensory objects basically and different ones and also objects that will encourage you as the early years practitioner or the parent to actually um, stimulate their development, whether it's their cognitive development, their sensory development, their social development, and also their physical development and emotional development. So, um, so things like these, okay, we've got like the teddy bear and the teddy bear's got letters. So if you, when you're supervising this activity, playing with the babies, you can just um, sing um, nursery uh, what's it called sorry sing the alphabet to them a b c d e f g h i j k l m n p q r s t u v w x y and z now i know my a b c next time will you sing with me and then you can show them teddy bear they can play with it and um and then they are of course we've got some gloves here you can put gloves on and you can do the MC Wincy Spider song okay um MC Wincy Spider climbed up the water spout down came the rain and washed the spider out down out came the sun and dried up all the rain Incy wincy spider climb up the spots again so you can put both gloves on and do that and um, the children will be engaged and um, and then you can put the uh, the what's it called you can put some of this puppets on okay hand puppets on and you can do the squeaky sound <laughs> and you can show the babies okay or the baby if it's just your baby at home and then you have you can put books like this as well and they can feel you can run their hands over it and they can feel the the different textures you can read them the books the book the whole book and then you can do um the numbers as well okay so we've done this one before it's on our channel on our channel we've read this book before it's on our channel um, you can watch that and then um, just to get an idea and then you can do the dog as well the dog hand puppet woof woof dog woof woof dog woof 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 okay and um, and then you've got things like dog okay they can play with it woof 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 okay and then we've got this one okay and again with this one you can even take it with you on the go um toes that you can take on the go you can just stick this on their pram as well okay but if they're not out and about on the go um you can actually set it up for them okay set it up for them on the floor on a nice little blankie or a nice little fabric like this one and um they can just sit on there and you sit with them of course and then do the diff the the different um, what's it called? Put out the different toys and play with them. Okay, so let's do this one. It says flip and fun. Alligator ate apples. Munch, munch, munch. Bear builds blocks. So you can even set up blocks, building blocks next time for them. Um, you can put um, fake apples around a few of them.
set it up next time for them and then cat cray colors crayons cat colors crayons okay so if you have a toy cat you can put it there and if you have um of course babies wouldn't do the the colors or like that um colors like that just because of safety but you can put things like paint and they can do some painting okay so this is to get them familiar with words so you can say cat meow dog digs dirt okay so you can do dog woof 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 okay so if they if if you have toddlers around as well you can um you can set up activities for them like this using that as example so you can set up building blocks so bear builds blocks so words that starts with b and words that starts with a so it's just to encourage them their language development basically okay and then of course they're going to be feeling the different textures crinkly crinkly sound soft and then squeaky sound so that that is an idea of something that you can set up for babies and also toddlers um, for their language development and their sensory development as well as their physical development because they're going to be touching the different and holding the different toys okay until next time Bye.